Alright, this is a speed test comparison between two extremely interesting phones. The one to the left is the Pixel 2 XL uh, running uh, Qualcomm's uh, most powerful chip, the Snapdragon 835 of 2017. And to the right, the LG G7 ThinQ running Qualcomm's uh, most powerful processor of this year, 2018, the Snapdragon 845 octa-core processor. You know, in terms of speed, I imagine I would uh, feel that both these phones would be at equal speed. Keep in mind, the Pixel 2 XL might be running last year's software, but there's just one thing to keep in mind. The Pixel 2 XL has become a lot faster after the Android Pie update, so I expect this to be an extremely even match as far as uh, speed is concerned. But as far as RAM management is concerned, I fully expect the LG G7 Think You to take the match because it's got 6 GB of RAM compared to just a mere 4 GB of RAM in the Pixel 2 XL. So let's start the speed test with the dialer in 1, 2, 3, Think You. Messaging, one, two, three. Thank you again. Uh, Play Store in one, two, three. Thank you again. So far, the thank you is pretty much beating the Pixel to Excel and everything. Uh, now, Chrome browser. Thank you again. The camera in one, two, three. A Pixel to Excel was marginally faster over there. Uh, Facebook in one, two, three. Pixel to XL marginally faster. Uh, Instagram in one, two, three. Pixel to XL. WhatsApp in one, two, three. Thank you much faster over there. All right, moving on to uh, Flipkart in one, two, three. Thank you again. Amazon in one, two, three. Uh, the Pixel, no. It was the Pixel 2 XL that finished that faster. All right, now moving on to YouTube in one, two, three. About the same. Now moving on to Gmail in one, two, three. LG G7, thank you, much faster over there. All right, now moving on to high-intensive applications like the game Asphalt Line in one, two, three. G7, thank you. It's much quicker. By about 7-8 seconds. Now, that was a huge difference. Alright, now moving on to Subway Surfers. This should be a pretty even one. In one, two, three. Again, the G7, thank you, is about 5 seconds fast. I mean, it's when it comes to the gaming, there seems to be a big difference in both these phones. And finally, Temple Run in one, two, three. And the D7 think you just seems a lot faster as far as the games are concerned. And it is over here as well. Right around two seconds. So now, moving on to the memory management. This is where I, you know, anticipate or expect the Pixel 2 XL to lose very badly because its RAM management, let me be honest, has been really pathetic. So anyway, let's uh, see how many uh, apps are in memory, starting with the dialer. G7 think you has it in memory. The Pixel reloaded that. Uh, message, again in memory on the G7 think you. Uh, Play Store, in memory in both. Chrome, the G7 think you has it in memory. The Pixel to Excel again miserably fails over there. Uh, moving on to the uh, camera. G7, thank you again, ready to go. Facebook, G7, thank you again in memory. Instagram, again in memory on the G7, thank you. WhatsApp, G7, thank you. Oh no, they both have that in memory. Flipkart, G7, thank you again has it in memory. Pixel 2 Excel is just failing miserably over here. Amazon, 
again in memory on the G7ThinQ to Pixel 2 XL. It's just reloading everything. YouTube, again in memory on the G7ThinQ. The Pixel 2 XL again reloads it. Gmail, again in memory on the G7ThinQ. Pixel 2 XL, well, really bad. Asphalt 9, let's see if the G7ThinQ has the games in memory. One, two, three. And it does. And the Pixel, as usual, reloads. Moving on to Subway Surfers. In memory again, Pixel again reloads. And finally, Temple Run in 1, 2, 3. You know, the G7 ThinQ has just annihilated the Pixel 2 XL over here. As far as speed of the phones are concerned, also, the G7 ThinQ is an extremely fast phone. The Snapdragon 845 is clearly faster than the Snapdragon 835 used in the Pixel 2 XL. Despite the Pixel 2 XL having the latest uh, Android Pie update uh, installed in it, I cannot imagine how fast the G7 ThinQ will become uh, once it receives the Android uh, Pie update. So that's it for the speed test between the Pixel 2 XL and the LG G7 ThinQ. I hope you guys really like the video. If you guys are interested in following me from here on, I'd appreciate you guys to go ahead and hit the subscribe button and right after that, hit the bell icon so that you guys get notified with the latest and greatest videos I'll be putting up on YouTube from here on. So as it is, as always, I wish all of you a tremendous day ahead of you. Ciao for now.